another episode of Minecraft Easing. Not so secret Saturday. Last we left off, we made this little lava blade. Kind of realized that there might be a problem in terms of chickens getting through. Uh, not, not quite sure how to deal with that without also oh, uh, kind of pulverizing everything. That might just be a big issue. But like th this, this works perfectly. This works perfectly, and I am happy with it. The question is what to do with this. Like, you see? How, how much damage? One, two, three. Interesting. Uh, next thing that I was thinking about working on was this. The zombie spawner. I kind of wanted to just kind of incorporate this into the design somehow. So my thought process is, I'm going to need to have a way for these guys to sort of feed into the, this killing system. Because there's no real reason to not, right? So I, I'm just thinking, hey, I have a spawner here. Why don't we use it? So my, my, my idea is I'm going to loop this because mobs float. As far as I can tell, they float. And I literally know roughly where the uh, system ends. So I can just kind of have them just kind of get pushed into this wall and then just drop them in somewhere up above. Oh. oh. This might not be as foolproof as I thought. Uh, let's see what I can do about that. Jog right here. Basically, the idea is we want them in the kill zone as long as possible. Um, stop. Everyone, stop. There we go. Um, this kind of makes this difficult. That needs to say, but I can't move this. I got it. I think I have come up with the solution. I should keep them staying put. I guess I see you. Um. Uh, 
just need more animals to kind of come on through here. One task. Because animals hop. They, they will inherently just bounce. So I'm thinking that if I just kind of rotate the collection point and this also just kind of doubles into what I need to do anyway if I use this side of the wall to collect things kind of branch it back into this thing The problem with this, though, this entire thing kind of is, like, I'm trying to collect it while it's live, and I'm not entirely certain of the spawn rate the further I get away from it. So... I was hoping to have it up here because that's like as close as I can physically get to this thing. But it appears that it might not be possible. And I guess we can just kind of begin moving this stuff. Oh, right. And they're surviving. The surviving part is the not so great part. I'm not sure how to fix this. So, I'm actually just going to ignore this. I'm going to ignore this. It works, kind of, with the big asterisk. It's worse with an asterisk. Just going to... Pass with the block. Sadly, it's much faster with the block. So, what we're just going to do then is we're just going to leave it as is. And just pray. I could probably, in theory, make it a secondary kill system for if they, when they get out. Honestly, this kind of does the job it needs to do. Look at all these animals in here. Really nice. Really, really nice. Let's just dump all the cobble. Uh, dirt. Dump that in here, I guess. I don't think I'll get much more of that here. Alright. Now let us check on the status of the... Uh, grass Because it's kind of the whole the reason why we were trying to make that thing anyway was just the grass to grow Well, it's growing just 
fear. It is here. We can say that much, which means I can finally get to this floor. Everything else is just rolling. Grab all of this. Right, we can place this dirt back now. That's how to deal with boiling water. I'm not gonna try it. Mm. You're gonna make me deal with this, aren't you? I can't see. How much this hits? I got most of that. Okay, it got everything important. I don't see any floating blocks anymore. Perfect, perfect. I don't think the grass will die underwater, so basically we just kind of got mossy ground underwater. We got moss. Which is a nice aesthetic. Some life underneath the seafloor. Now this needs to grow. Can't work on this part without it. Um... Yeah, this is, uh, really this route right here is what it needs to go. I think I actually need to take this out now that I think about it. This needs to go. Because it needs to come through here. Perfect! Got some more glass, so let's actually punch in the ceiling here. Stupid sponge. Hmm. You know what? I think I know what I can do. This hallway sort of dead ends, but I could kind of make this a really big room. Just a room, or like a like a penthouse room. You know, for for the top one percent, made of like a complete glass dome surrounding the top and back. Could do something like that, because like, we obviously we got like. You pay. You paying good money. Like you can. You want to see outside. This, this. This is your premium option. Over here, we've got our sort of cheapo option. You don't really get to have the headspace. Kind of just sleep by the door. I mean, I can switch that, but it's not hard. Just let's let's see how that looks. Probably looks strange. Oh yeah, there's a spider dungeon under this one. A haunted spooder. See, so, like, not the greatest view, obviously, but you get what you paid for, which will, which clearly, clearly, you you only paid peasant cash for this room. So you 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 can still see you you're getting what you paid for. But this, this other room. Most certainly could use that fence, the fancy, fancy stick. Like, glass surrounding it all. You know, all the bells and whistles. It kind of like, it gets the same treatment as the, um... Wow, 
Ah, you know those two pieces of glass? Short two. Ah, it hurts. It hurts so much. Yeah, it'll, it can get the kitchen treatment. Water. Water, 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 water. I will, I will promote water. Let's go. I don't think we have any seeds out here. We got, or at least we got, no, we don't have seeds. Unfortunate. Unfortunate, unfortunate, unfortunate. No biggie. No. Oh no, 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 this was a bad idea. Doing it right here, bad idea. Actually, uh, need to not do it right here. Gotta go find somewhere else for our seeds. So we'll do it the sword way. I did get one seed, so I could do this the long and tedious way of just waiting for plants to grow, but I don't want to do that. I know boats everywhere. Oh, that looks good. So we'll get some seeds, and we can and then we can kind of put like a sort of underground garden to help fill out that garden. You know, I don't think I've seen any cyan flowers. Supposedly there are cyan flowers to account for the fact that lapis doesn't exist here, but I haven't seen any. So. Disappointing, actually. So we got seven. Ah, it's a skeleton. I don't want what you're selling. I already got what I need. Let's get out of here. Go, 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 go. Stick, stick, rock. I don't know what else we can really grow. We can't grow pumpkin. Oh wait, no, pumpkins don't exist here. Pumpkins don't really exist here. We got wheat. We got three different types of flowers, of which I only have two, and then the sugar cane, which are already down here. Mushrooms, maybe, but that requires the darkness. 
and I am not keen to make a dark spot down here. And I have spent an atrocious amount of time trying to keep it lit. Well, actually, so. Like this, and the wonderful, the wonderful part about water, at least farming, is that it travels four. So I can actually do this. And this will still work. Okay. Little humble garden down here now. Hopefully that grows quickly. Uh, yeah. I think that'll do it. Uh, I hope you all enjoyed watching, and we will see you all on the next episode of Minecraft Easting. That's a secret Saturday. Goodbye!